Let's take a look at uh, the layout of Microsoft Projects. The program interface itself is made up of the tools that you can use when working on the program itself. Now, at the top there, you will see there are um, little tools that you can quickly use to do some duties in Microsoft uh, Projects, like the save button, uh, the undo, the redo. This is called your quick access uh, toolbar, so you can quickly access all those menus here by actually going into this toolbar. Further, you will see that uh, there is the title bar there, which displays the title of the current project. Um, when you save your project for the first time, the name of the project or the file itself will display in there. Moving away from the title bar, there is the ribbon. Like any other Microsoft Office program, the ribbon is made up of tabs, which groups uh, related menus together. So if uh, you will be using uh, the tasks, you will see that under the task tab, there will be different uh, groups of menus, your forms, your schedules, um, your tasks, your inset. So those are the actual menus that are within uh, the tab tasks. Now, the most important part of your Microsoft project would be the project display or the view. Now, by default, when you open Microsoft projects, you will find that uh, the Gunchart view is the default view. Now, this actually gives you access to scheduling your tasks, putting in durations, putting in the date for the durations, the start date and the finish date for your duration. Now, on the far left side, uh, right side of your screen, you will see that um, later when we start a project from scratch, you will see that uh, once you start scheduling your tasks in here, then uh, this side will display a chart which actually um, tells you about your project itself. So you will see when we open the project for the first time um, that um, a, a gun chart will build as and when we start scheduling tasks. Now, you can actually go in and change the views of your, um, your, your project. So in this view, we are on the gun chart. We can go into the project calendar, which actually displays your project in a calendar view. Now, um, this would be the days when your task starts, the days when your task ends, and so on, up until you know, the, the last part of your, your, your project date can also go in and um, view uh, the resource sheets, which is um, a sheet that will have resources that you're going to be using in your project. Now, this will include resources like people. It will include resources like material. That is the material you'll be using. And the, the resource sheet will actually have uh, details about that particular resource. We will uh, talk about that later. We can also go in and look at your network diagram. If you click on the network diagram, it will show you the network diagram, which illustrates for you in a network way that um, your first part of the project starts here. The duration of the project is actually a summary of your project in a diagram way. So later on, we will open a pro an existing project and look at the project and look at the network diagram as uh, it builds on your your project window. Now the default view will be the gun chart.